Ethiopia is one of the oldest and richest cultures in the world. This is the birthplace of mankind, the home of Lucy, Ardi, and many of the so-called missing links. But there are also traces of the very first fishermen here at the Ethiopian National Museum. I've been allowed access behind the scenes at uh, the museum, and in this very room are some of the oldest human remains anywhere in the world. But what I'm looking at at the moment are some of the earliest ever fishing implements. It's fairly clear that these were used for fish because in the same place were found remains of fish. They found a skull there. Just the skull was three foot long, so the whole fish, seven, eight foot, something like that. So whoever was using these harpoons here could have been after some fairly interesting fish back then. I'm overwhelmed to be this close to the earliest tools of my trade. It turns out that this skull belonged to a giant Mputa or Nile perch. It looks like this modern day monster has been a valued prize for thousands of years. The ancient Egyptians revered Nile perch for the amount of food they could provide. They even mummified these sacred fish and entombed them with their dead. That's actually, okay, it's after a Nile perch. But that's a nice sized catfish. 70 pounds, something like that, but beautiful fish, lovely, beautiful coloration, very strong as well.